Hi, it's Jim at Atlantic British. I take care of the technical support here. Today we're underneath our Disco 2 trying to answer a question that was sent in about a recall that Rover has on the drive shaft couplings. The confusing part is people think it's all the cars, but it's not. It's a car that had a recent repair to the coupling on the rear drive shaft. This is the coupling they're talking about. If you had this done, I would say in the last six months, the recall may apply. Um, they have a list of cars that got a replacement coupling. Basically, in the recall, they're having you check for certain things on the replaced part. I can show you what to look for. If you recently replaced your flex joint and you're wondering about if your car is under this recall thing, what you need to do is inspect the part that's on your car or have your shop do it. What you're looking for is make sure it says made in Germany here and there's a little logo by the original equipment company here. As you can see this is a genuine rover part. Actually the bad parts were genuine rover parts. They just went to another supplier. I don't know if they were trying to cut a little cash or what. but. Here at Atlantic British, we have the correct one. That answers that question on our Disco too. We had another question. A guy had a series Land Rover. I actually own one of them myself. He was looking for Lucas headlights. We also have a, a part on our website you can go to, and you can actually get to our sales staff to answer a question like, where can I get original Lucas headlights for my series truck? I think that would be the place to go. Uh, right off the top of my head, I have no idea where you can get them. I know we don't have them on the shelf. But anyway, if you have questions, don't hesitate to give us a call. 1-800-533-2210. All our sales staff can answer most any of your questions. Or it will get a funnel down to me and we'll get you the answer. Or just check us out on roverparts.com. Another question we got on the Facebook was about Range Rover, and I believe it was a P38 ABS problems. I believe it was about sensors. The best answer for that is you really got to get somebody to plug into your car, or you can do it with the appropriate tool that you could buy from us. It's a little on the expensive side. And see what faults are in it. Um, usual faults are air gaps, stuff like that, but uh, if the light's on, there's a fault in there, you need to pull a code and just send us the code or call us, call it in and ask our salespeople. Again, it's 1-800-533-2210 or roverparts.com and give us the code and we can probably tell you what part you need.